There is no problem in DP. There's actually a revival in DP. Because uh, a party like DP can renew itself. In the 1960s, we had a leader of opposition called Basil Bataringaya. He defected to UPC with 20 members of parliament. 20! And only four MPs remained in parliament who are loyal to DP. But today, nobody writes about Bataringaya. It was just like a passing wind. But people write about Ben Kiwanoka who stood firm. So, nobody who wants to defect should blackmail DP. As leader of DP, I lead according to the party constitution. <coughs> there are those who may have disagreements, but DP makes decisions through its organs. And when we make a decision, whether you agree with it or not, you must obey the decision. It is getting a bit late for the opposition to unite. So most likely, Ugandans will have to decide. Unfortunately, when the opposition is divided, Ugandans may be demoralized. So what we are going for now, we are coming in the election as a DP, pure and simple. We want to keep DP green. Dobo of Singapore Renzururu cannot have a political party. All political parties belong to the Obusinga. Because NRM also has subjects of the Omusinga. FDC also has subjects of the Omusinga. DP also has subjects of the Omusinga and all the other parties. Therefore, no party should think that it owns the Omusinga. 